Nacho Average Tabletop. Woohoo! Welcome to Nacho Average Tabletop. I'm Zach, and today I'm going to be unboxing Panda Royale. And this was provided to us by Last Night Games. So uh, thank you for sending us this. Uh, we're going to take a look. I Well, Panda Royale or Panda Royal. I'm not really sure. I like to call it Royale. It just sounds fancier. And I believe this is a very a dice-based game. Uh -huh. So I'm always excited when you get to roll some dice. Uh, that's always a fun thing. And there's something fun about this cover. It's got this weird kind of bamboo almost going across. It's just a an interesting cover, and I I, just, I really like <laughs> really like what it's doing there. It's just unique. Um, yeah, we got some last night games. Here's. Um, I think all their previous titles, and they've actually sent us all of these, so uh, we have content on these if you want to check any of those out. We've got some playthroughs and reviews, so definitely check any of those out that sound interesting to you. Um, yeah, this is Panda Royale. Looks like there's not too many rules here, which I always like, I always appreciate. Um, yeah, it <laughs> looks pretty minimal, and looks like, yeah, just kind of has the setup. I think this one will be a quick one to learn. Hopefully we can get it to the table really soon. And nice, nice bag here with a panda on it. <laughs> looks pretty cool. Um, ooh, and it's actually tied up. It's all tied up. Let's see if I can get this untied and opened up. Ooh, and actually on the back, there's a panda. Well, I don't know, I guess... One side's the back, one side's the front. There's a panda, and then you got Panda Royale, so that's pretty cool. This bag feels pretty good quality, pretty decent quality here. Uh, we've got a ton of dice in here. So, I believe if I remember right, all the different d types of dice do or score in different ways, uh, which I, I think is just really cool. It's a maybe a simple concept, but I, I love rolling dice, so... I'm hoping that I get to roll quite a few of them on here. Uh, I like that you got some some unique ones in here too. So you got like these ones with kind of some sparkles in there. Uh, these red ones have half the faces black, half white. Because I think if I remember right, that one's like half of them are positive, half are negative. Uh, so you got a lot of different dice in there. I think I've probably got most of the different kinds, but yeah, you got uh, a large number of them. How many there are. I think it said there's like 100 dice in there. Let me double check. Yeah, this is a large bag. My hand sometimes doesn't fit in some of the game bags, but this one fits pretty well, and it feels like this is going to hold together pretty well, which is a nice thing considering uh, it's going to be pretty important to hold all those dice. We've got a smaller bag here, kind of the same Panda Royale and Panda on it. This one I don't think my hand is going to fit in. I don't remember what this one's used for, but hopefully, uh, hopefully, I don't have to grab too much out of there because, yeah, my hand will will not fit that well. Then we've got a little. I'm not sure if there's a first player token. It's cardboard. Pretty cute looking panda. And got some pencils here. Uh, so you got the eraser. This makes me think of a golf pencil. It's about that size. So you get a decent amount of them. I think it's probably ten because I. I think on the box is up to 10 players, so I don't remember if, let me see here, those are the different rounds I was going to say, I can't remember if maybe you could play with more, you just need more pencils, and the inside of the box has the Panda Royale, but yeah, otherwise I think you're just pretty much marking down your score here, so here's kind of what the different dice do, and then you'll just take your, your totals, so I have different rounds. Looks like the yellows are the only ones that score in the first round, maybe? I'm not 100% sure. Uh, but yeah, I'm looking forward to trying this one out. There's not too much in the box, but I'm looking forward to trying this one out. Like I said, kind of with those other videos, we had done some other content alongside this, so definitely check out the ones for Panda Royale. Uh, we'll have probably a review and a, possibly a playthrough, so check those out if you want to see how the game plays and what we think of it. But otherwise, we hope to see you on those other videos, and as always, don't forget to keep on nibbling on our content.